everybody, it's Tracy. Welcome back to my channel. Um, sorry for the little congested voice having some, uh, I don't know if it's like a slight cold or allergy issues, but in any case, um, I apologize for that in advance. Um, but today I have a Planner Kate haul for you. So there is her information. And also you can always use PK Love 20 for 20% 20 off your order, including sales orders. Um, I got some really great samplers. So I have the little dots some gray boxes, some scripts, um, some like dual sided, uh, headers, payday flags, and some font. So those are awesome. Now, before I get into these, I want to get into this first. So I went ahead and I ordered, um, May through September, which finishes up the year that I would end up having in my plum paper, because I've decided um, probably on Black Friday, I'm going to go ahead and order the uh, next six months of my plum paper social media planner that I'm using right now, the vertical priorities. So this is the one for May. And I wanted them all to kind of match. So that was why I decided to go ahead and do this. So here's May. Um, let's do this way. Here's June. Love this pattern. There's July. Here's August. And then here is September, which is absolutely gorgeous. When I saw this, this actually um, led me into, I'm probably going to get a kit of this for next year because I really love the apples. I don't have children and I don't have anybody off to school. So I kind of overlooked it. But now that I saw the header with all the beautiful apples, I'm like, that's still just beautiful for fall. So I will probably get a kit of that for next year. Now, that being said, so those are my actual uh, calendar pages. And then what I did was also get a uh, thin washi. This is uh, January. This one is February. This is March. This is April. Then we've got May, which matches this one. June. July, I love this washi. August. September, and then this matches the October that's in my planner now, and this will match next month for November. So what I decided to do was get extra washi, thin washi, to go on those dashboard pages. Now, I've also since considered I might try getting um, some of the dashboard pages for the plum paper that have like the three circles, um, because I may not order from plum paper, I may not order... Um, the neutral dividers. I really like the colorful tabs. So I think I'm gonna try and make that dashboard work. Um, and actually, let me go ahead and show you what I'm talking about. Um, actually, I have to get up and get it. So these are the um, tabs for the plum paper. So I've decided um, I'm gonna go ahead and try getting Planner Kate um, kits for this because I've come up with a way that I might possibly use this, which I will get into in another video because I will probably be resetting my social media planner as soon as I get those pages. Um, but I've decided I'm not gonna order um, like another planner. I am probably going to get um, a notebook uh, from Plum Paper so that I can uh, have, you know, the added paper that I need. Um, and I've, I've, I've thought about ways that I can change what I'm doing uh, to work. So I will probably order, like I said, a couple of the Planner Kate kits for those dashboards and give those a try. Um, and then I'll go from there. But in the meantime, I'm really happy with this because uh, I really love my planner. And just in, as a side note, let me show you my October... And you should have already seen um, the video for this. So that's the, uh, that's the page that goes opposite the dashboard. So this is where the dashboard would actually go. Um, and that's why I'm thinking I really would like to get the one that matches that. So we'll, we'll see. Um, I'm really considering that. Um, but again, 
this is my monthly. So I really love uh, the plum paper. I like uh, the way it's working. Um, this is my first act actual week in it and I'm really enjoying it. So I'm hoping that that continues um, because I feel like I do have a little bit more writing space. I feel like things are a little bit more organized um, on my weekly layout and I'm really enjoying it. So I'm glad to have these to add to my collection to um, work with my plum paper. And I just wanted to share this with you guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will talk to you all in the next one. Bye.